Hi guys, this is another episode of Wake Up with Jim and Sab. Since the quarantine started, we have been doing daily shows. We're uploading them on Sab's YouTube page. Check them out. Um, we talk about the quarantine. We talk about what we've been doing. And for today's episode, we have a guest. He is Diego Castillo of Sandwich, Sweet Ecstasy, The Jegos. Basically, he's our super, super duper good friend, and we always love hanging out with him. Um, actually, we really became close when uh, Sandwich and Cheats went on a U.S. tour. So we super hung out with him and his wife. He recently got married to Nikki. Um, yeah, and they're such a wonderful couple. Anyway, Jego is the master storyteller. That's why we wanted him on this podcast. Um, not only is he an amazing storyteller, he's uh, an amazing salesman. So throughout the episode, you'll see that he'll give you know he'll give his advice or parang his recommendation. And sobrang mabibenta kami. As in right after, while we were doing the episode, Sab was taking notes. Uh, of his recos. So it's a really fun episode. I think we need to do a part two because usually when we hang out, uh, it's usually what, three to four, five hours, six hours. So here in this episode, we get Jego's recommendations for music, books, zombie movies. Anyway, it's a really, we have a really great time and we're going to have his wife, Nikki, on the show next to talk about. Uh, financial management. So, hope you enjoy the show. Welcome to the Wake Up With Your Zap Podcast. Welcome to the new world. Hey! hey. Jago hey. Castillo is with us. Hi, hi guys. Hey, Jim hey. and Sav. Thanks yeah. for having me, y'all. This is a dream come true. We've been wanting you on the show. Lies. No, it's true. It's true because Jago has the best stories ever about the yeah. music scene, about uh, well, the cheese miss. He has the a lot cheese. Of cheese. <laughs> <laughs> and well, ako, personally, I really enjoy it when I hear um, your stories about my dad. So we'll oh, get, thank we'll you. get well, to that later. Well, on. yeah, your dad, your dad, your dad's awesome. So Thanks. yeah, I have a lot of <laughs> stories about your dad. Pero before we get there, um, am I screaming? Are yeah? Are we loud? Uh, no, am I? I'm trying to. Oh, I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying my best because my wife told me earlier. Ko, ka na naman <laughs> excited. So para temper kay sarili ko para kunyari, cool ako. Hey guys, <laughs> shout out score? to shout out to Mrs. Castillo by the way who yeah. will guest on hey, this love. podcast. Shout, shout out to sayo. Can you hear? Yay, thank you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. All right. Okay. Uh, well, siguro to one, one, one thing. Matagal na namin pinaplan talaga to 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 have you on the show. Oh, thank you. Uh, but siguro before we start, we want to ask how has life in quarantine been? Wait, uh, so sorry, sorry. Before that, sorry. Uh, yeah, For the benefit ahead. of the people. Can you make like a intro naman. for Jago? Well, a pl- a plan ako kasi sana. Meron ako voiceover. Okay. Before that. Well produced pala to. May, may post, <laughs> oh, may post production pa. Okay. 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 <laughs> sige, you intro him. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. May, may intro. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> I will email you what to say. <laughs> no, 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 I'm kidding. Yes, you're at, you're so saying. Quarantine. How, how's it been? Uh, well, it, obviously, it, it, it's, it's difficult, but... Uh, what I realize is that I really am a homebody past a certain point. Mm. Uh, I'm not I'm not trying to make light na para madalito. Of course, it's it, it isn't especially for for a majority of you know our uh, the people out there. But coming magasawa since we're if we're not playing like what we do for a living mm. and we're I really am just at home uh, mm-hmm. playing music and mm-hmm. cooking. And I think uh, what we're trying is to try and make everything as normal as humanly possible, at least in our home setting, because the more I panic, I'm a panicky kind of guy. Mm-hmm. So it affects uh, my wife. <laughs> and, yeah. and if I exude some sort of negative energy, I don't want to do it. It's not going to help. So I just try to, you know, try to 
do the regular routine. I still clean, we still cook, mm-hmm. we still watch. We last yesterday we were doing parang board game of sorts. Right? <laughs> <laughs> we were reading. We we uh, we did all, all sorts of things. You know, we try to just keep ourselves busy, and we obviously we keep up with the the, the news, and we call our friends. Uh-huh, mm. That's nice. Uh, that's I nice. call I call Rames. I call Silamong. Yeah, thanks for the call, call by the way. Call. Thank you. Uh, oh, yes, yes. <laughs> I, I actually called Jim. He called me. Uh, yes, Thank it, you. So, he called me the other yes, day. Yes, I, I, I call yeah. my friend. Because I feel, diba? No, but that's both. That's for both of you. That, that's, <laughs> that's, that's for your... Because I call. No, no, no. That, but that's for your family, diba? <laughs> okay, that's like nice. Said, Wait, how, how often have you been um, refreshing your feed? Refreshing my That's my feed and what? Parang um, <laughs> screen time has gone up exponentially. Yeah. Have okay. you been super scrolling to refresh, okay. refresh, refresh? Okay, That's a very good question. Oddly, <clears throat> oddly enough, I have let go of Facebook theoretically in a long time. Kami mm-hmm. It's not like we're on there anymore too much. Yeah. yeah. The only reason that I'm on there is to check up now, Shepard, to check up on friends, mm-hmm. to ask. You know, I've been using Facebook Messenger, for example, yeah. a lot mm-hmm. to you know, call my brother, call friends in the States, people that we went on tour with in New York and yeah. LA. Kasi, diba, kasama yun, you check up on them. And I realized na kahit five minutes of conversation, laking tulong. Eh. Yeah. But yeah, my usage is, you know, I've been, I see everybody playing music, which is great. I see yeah. everybody DJing. I see everybody mm-hmm. like, I've been studying bass from somebody na parang gulong bass ito. Ah. So, you know, <laughs> stuff like that. So, uh-huh. so yeah, the usage has been there. But, I also try to just sort of, uh, you know, pass a certain point. Just because sometimes I heighten my kapraningan ko if I mm-hmm. if I read the wrong news, and yeah. so you know, you know what I'm saying. So I'm just like, okay, but but overall, yeah, there's nothing else to do past a certain point. Eh. So <laughs> Pero, I'm there. I don't know, Jegs. Because na katawa. Ako, I've been off Facebook for like I think I'd say years. two, three years now. Um, yeah, never yeah, I still it. I still tag you every once in a while. Oh. <laughs> and parang kumbaga if I if I get a tag, okay. Pero parang I I know kasi how toxic it is. Pero we don't really yes. post there anymore. Naging safe space, yeah. naging naging spa- safe, safe safe space namin sa bang Twitter. Yes. And Instagram. Yes. Pero and Instagram. Have you been on Twitter lately? I, I, that's another platform that I'm not, you know, I'm on Twitter, mm. pero grabe din siya. Hey, hello guys. I saw you. Hello. Yan. Yan. Okay, 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 okay. you're back. Um, Ayan, oh, you're back. You're back. You're back. Yeah, no, I've been on Twitter. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. I don't, I don't, I don't know what happened. Baka yeah, yung eh. internet ko. <laughs> the whole building kasi naka-wired dito. Yeah, I've been on Twitter. Pero yun lang, mga updates lang. Mga ano. Why? What's on Twitter, guys? It's very chaotic. Mm. Uh, I yes. had to, I had to delete it. Ako kasi, ano ako eh, medyo Twitter yeah. is my go-to talaga. Yes, and yes. I like, uh, well, usually on a normal day, I mean, I, I would like reading people's uh, tweets, retweets, funny memes, yes, and um, opinions. Yes. But now it's just, it's very, very stressful. Talaga. Last night I almost, I had a mini breakdown. Um, parang I was getting a little depressed because, uh, you know, reading a lot about my friends' ano, parang dealing with death because they lost yeah. their moms and yeah. Yeah. a lot yeah. of mga parents na affected. Yeah. Uh, bigang nurse at doctor. Yeah. And yeah. It's just very scary thinking about uh well coming gym where parents to two young boys and that's just, right. We have no idea what the world will be. I don't I can't even say after this because I don't think I just can't imagine it right now. What's gonna happen after this? You know. Yes. <laughs> no, I don't mean to. I don't mean no, to. No, 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 no. Like, by the way, by the, sorry, no, sorry. no, 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 no. I, 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 I don't think there really is going to be. By the way, and not to be. There, there, yeah, there's going to be an after this, but things are going to change. It's we a new normal. That. It's going yeah. to be a new you know, normal. Sorry, I, 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 I forgot to schedule this. I need to breastfeed. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay. no, of, course, no, no. of course, of course. Um, <laughs> parang, uh, to, uh, continuing what, what Sab was saying, parang, yeah. I was also thinking about it. Parang, there's going to be the new normal. 
So yeah, yeah it's, it's, we were going to get over it. Things are going to be better, but I think things are going to change. <clears throat> yeah, actually, ang sinabi nga sa, kasi my ate is in Singapore, and like, she said that, you know, the way things are being communicated there are completely different from what we're receiving, diba? Yes. For them, it's, they're say, they've been told, even before it, you know, hit the peak, they were told talaga na, expect this to be at least a year. A year, yeah. Expect a year of this whole new world, diba? This whole new world, exactly, yeah. yeah. Um, so, I guess parang, kami ni, like, that's why I asked her to delete the Twitter kasi, if kay sa inyo ni Negi kami dalawa ni Sab pareho kaming praning yeah uh, and so what we what the only thing we can do and what we've been sharing on this podcast is that you know the best thing you can do is manage yourself during this time true diba? true true so with that actually kaya kita gusto tanungin uh, wait I wanted to add I wanted to no, add you have to th- 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 sorry sorry to cut you that's exactly correct and if you do not take care of yourself how can you take care of others yeah. I'm just saying you, it Definitely. starts with it starts with you kayo you know we're, we're building a family there's, good, there's lots of people who are about you know you take care of yourselves you take yeah. this seriously because when the time comes na kailangan mo nang, I don't want to sound like ano, ah, then we'll get into our funny things but that's yeah. the truth diba kailan di mo pa bayan sarili mo kasi my wife depends on me uh sab depends you depend on each other so kailangan okay tayo anyways you, i agree with you 110% that's what tama 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 and what do you think ano um well siguro right now kasi you, if you haven't been watching Jego has been posting uh, his DJ sets on <laughs> that Instagram. gets flagged. <laughs> Are they, you last coin did a flag, eh? Put it lang. Okay, uh, yes, thank you. Um, so he's been posting his DJ sets, and what are, is there anything else that like you're thinking? Are, are you because I, I always imagined you writing something, yeah, that's uh, <clears throat> I think, I think right now I can't think of cataloging what's happening kasi masyadong in the moment gets mo Jim para yes that's I was going to write something about my experience as a Filipino in a rock and roll band and yeah. where I went through but now I can't think of any of those things honestly para hindi ko siya maiisip eh para day to day you just want to be like hey what can we do to you know to foster some sort of happiness online like what <clears throat> Sab was saying, parang kung post lang ako, wala akong negative na pinopost. Do I disagree with a lot of things? Hells yeah. Kilala mo ako eh. <laughs> Pero parang uh, hindi ko na gagawin. Kasi too much energy spent to be going back and forth with whoever. Ako pa, you know me. Pero isa ko na lang, post na lang ako ng just positive stuff, stuff. You know? Yeah. So, as for writing... Siguro went down the line na lang. But I still want to do my rock and roll book. Kasi oh I've man, this. that would be been, so cool. You know, I share, mm-hmm. a lot of, I share a lot of stories with you guys and anybody else. Na, even on my Foaming at the Mouth, kailangan oh. ko lang put pen to paper from 13 years old or 12 years old where it began hanggang ngayon. Diba? Kasama kayo lahat eh. Kailangan yeah. ko lang editor. Editor lang kasi 5,000 pages. <laughs> <laughs> Para ano ba yung magandang kweto? Ano yung hindi? Ang dami ko nakita, Jim. Yeah, you know, I mean, well, because um, one thing that she uh, shared with us, Jego, is the love for Wilco. Yes, and um, I, I've been sharing on the podcast that, like, the book of Jeff Tweedy is like that's a really that's a great book. It's like that's such a great book, and um, yun yai, um, I constantly recommend that uh, yes. for people, but for what I wanted to ask you is, um, what are your best, especially during these times, about okay. What books yes. would you recommend as the best autobiographies that you've read? Uh, uh, Just Kids, mm-hmm. which is uh, uh, there's a there's a a book called Just Kids by uh, ano nga niya? Uh, uh, Hold on, can you? Uh, uh, I'll show it to you guys. But do we jump cut to or hindi? Okay lang. But do it. Kaya naman. But <laughs> uh, uh, Patty Smith's uh, Just Kids. Uh-huh. Ayan, Nikki will get it. Uh, uh-huh. Patty Smith's Just Kids is a great, great book. It's sort of the something like a pattern. Because the story niya 
is she was a poet first in the 60s. So uh-huh. lahat dadaanan niya from tail end ng 60s na Beatles, punk movement nandun siya hanggang current movement. So ang ganda. So yun ang, mm. yun ang he, he, here it is. Oh, ah, okay, okay, okay. Okay. And so there's so many Addison, wonderful yeah, okay. Uh, so so that's a great book. Uh, the the obviously the Wilco book is great. That's yeah. a great music book. Uh, there is the Yola Tengo autobiography. Oh, they have. Ah, so ganda. Oh. Because Ira Kaplan Jim used to be a writer for the Village Voice, the singer and guitar player. Okay. So even in the seventies, he was reviewing all these these bands as a 16 year old so yun may kwento siya ng alam, blondie yung ganun din so may kita mo yung chronological order how he gets before he even picks up a guitar mm, I think oh. these are the most interesting to me kasi nagtatravel siya ng different genres na kahit di ka fan ng band per se yung kwento niya doon sa eksena na gusto mo Buo. Kasi insider yeah. stories eh. From, oh, may mga drug addict, mga chismis, mga andun yeah. lahat. Diba? Sa ikaw, pero, oh, stiga, ganun pala yun. You know, really, really cool stories. So, those are those are really cool books. The Wilco book, the, the Tweety book, for example, has a great arc. At first, I was telling Nikki na parang, hindi ko na ata gusto si Tweety ah. <laughs> yeah. But there's a moment na parang he's writing it na parang he seems to be a bit of an a-hole. Pero yeah. pala, pala yung ending, may reward ka and you're like, yeah. oh, hindi, ang galing niya pala. But that's a great, yeah. diba? Yeah, so, and even, ano, I mean, um, I think what makes the book so good is that, I mean, any autobiography is that it it goes so deep into the different phases of the life. That's right. So, parang and the different interactions and then the different tama yung sabi mo yung different settings like yeah. uh, for example tung itong book ni Tweedy um talking about uh, the 90s and talking about how yeah. uh, the yeah. shows would go uh what recent books na autobiographies that I've read actually Yeah, but have you read? Um I read yung kay Kerry Brownstein uh, 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 uh makes a hungry I don't know yeah I read that too. Uh, uh, lyric ng she, she's right there by the way no right <laughs> Hunger Makes a Modern Girl ah yeah, oh yeah there, yeah, there you yeah, go sila, yeah. Ayan, Hunger yeah. Makes was, a Modern Girl yeah maganda rin yan the, um, the, the Kim Gordon book is the awesome the Kim Gordon book is good I think the Kim Gordon book is better than the Carry one ako lang ah, personally yeah. uh, but they're both yeah. really good they're both really yeah, good yeah kasi ang ganda may dynamic pa of um, a broken love uh, yep. kay Kim Gordon ah uh, Ako naman, another thing, you know what I do? So, bad. Just uh, t- what I, to help me sleep. I, mm-hmm. yeah. To help me sleep, I read, I can't read autobiographies at night. Okay. Because, nagigising ko. Gising ka so pa ng, I, uh, yeah, yeah. I read fiction. Okay. So, um, the last book I read, sobrang malas pa, was Stephen uh-huh. King's The Stand. Tako. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. And basically, it's a it's what's happening now. Yeah. Uh, it's, a, it's a virus, and then the media covers it, and people That's right. freak out, and there's new civilizations that blah blah blah. Par pareho tayo. <laughs> so pareho tayong type thing na binabasa. Oh, okay. Well, what 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 fiction are you? Kaderaman kagabi we were the wife and I because you can download a lot of books online now na parang mm-hmm. because we're giving. The Plague by uh, how do you pronounce his name? Camus, Albert Camus', Albert Camus The Plague, which oh. came out in forty four. It's ganon din. It's about a small uh, uh, French village that has the plague. Pero the people plus lang pa kaya lang. okay lang yan. Uh-huh. And then there's one doctor who figures out that wait, this is more than just like you know random people killing over with fever. Uh-huh. And it's too late. Shepley when he's telling the authorities, wala na niniwala. <laughs> and then the whole town is quarantined, but it rained. Ba- oh, ganda! Nakakatakot na medyo oh. <laughs> nakakatawa. Wait, Actually, you said sinadya mo na because of what's happening? You read that? Or you yes, were reading it and then this happened? No, sinadya ko. Because, because you, you, you get a lot of insight about... This is... It's funny because this is, isn't new. Mm. The, if you go to my Twitter, there's quotes from the book there. Ah, na, that's what you've been sharing. Okay. Yeah, it's because... Plagues and war and all of these things are not new in human civilization and in our evolution. But people tend to forget ko ano nangyari. Na walang mga 
uh, safety measures in place because technology has overtaken everything. Okay na yan. Okay hmm. na to. Ganito. Tapos, people forget to, ano daw, parang the, the analogy is that you forget about science sometimes. There's yeah. a mouthpiece, especially in the States, there's some, there's some, their president can say like, all of these things, but, and, and, and everybody takes it as word. When, yeah. ang scientists dapat, kasi science has been telling us na pwede mangyari to, but nobody heeds their warning. So parang ganun yung binabasa ko. Nakakatakot, Jim. Parang, like, huh, Okay. Yeah. Anyways, something yeah. like that. Well, okay. well, you understand. Uh, again, this I read it right before this happened, uh, mm-hmm. and the the most interesting dynamic, aside from it becoming some crazy uh, Stephen King's crazy crazy thing, it it just you know just just showing how the government and how the media will, yes. will, will control the narrative that's actually yes. for me the scariest part the yes. now we yes. actually have no idea anyway uh what's another what's a book that can help you sleep at night that's not sleep, that's not scary <laughs> are you puro mga scary you know recently nagbasa ako ulit kasi nikin i watched the road the macormac the macormac book uh, yeah, but no. we had the book, so because I reread it, nakakatagod <laughs> din kasi. <laughs> but uh, entertaining wise, shucks, that's a good question. What did we read? What did I read recently? Oh, I'm reading. I know. Last night a DJ saved my life. Love babut nga. Last night DJ. No? DJ saved my life. <laughs> <laughs> this is, but this is. Wala ako lang ata may trip nito. Ah, cool. It, it's it's just basically a story, the story on how DJing came about. Oh, oh that's, that's so really interesting. So it's not just it's starting from the 1920s, ah, mm. when the records were invented. So very, sa akin ang, ang tuwa ako para oh, I come well, nox I come, eh, no? <laughs> come from a long line of people doing <laughs> doing cool things. So I, you know, here's my trivia. Oh. Can I can I give trivia from what go, I'm sure? Go. So, why is the record player called a jukebox? Diba? How weird, why? right? Why is it like yung, yung word the 45s? Because juke is what African Americans used to dance to. It's a sexual dance. Mm. It could be a verb, juking. Mm. Kaya ganun, ganun yung sayaw. Uh. So, the marketers of what whoever in parang Wurlitzer at said, we'll call it the jukebox. Oh. Galing, so yeah. so African Americans would go into these like little tiny bars. Tapos syempre, segregated sila ng time na yun. Tapos mm-hmm. meron silang they'd play all these Delta Blue stuff and they start dancing na uh, parang parang Beyoncé, <laughs> parang yeah. very sexually charged. Uh. Yeah, ganyan, 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 ganyan. <laughs> so, galing, so that's how that's how it came about. Ano ko galing ah. Is and there a the connection ter- with the boom box? Is there a dance move called the bo- I, a boom? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe because because lang malakas talaga yung tunog. But here's here's another thing. Jukebox <laughs> eventually became rock and roll, which is another African American parang slang for the same sort of thing. It's also sexual rocking and rolling nga eh. So yeah. ganda na story kasi like, ako oh, nga no. So so uh Marty Fried, I think the guy who coined the term, had already heard it. Well, parang coined it na rock and roll. Had already heard it from Af- from these African Americans dancing in the jukebox na rockin' and rolling. Mm. Galing lang, ba? So that's this book. So it makes me kind of happy na para oh, stiga. So it's wow. it's almost like a you know it's a history thing. You know, it's it's not it's not really uh, one story. It's a bunch of people parang interviewed to tell us the story of how. Uh, the the evolution of the DJ became the DJ that we know it now. Shit, oh. I wanna. That's I wanna nice. Yeah, that. uh, That's, uh, you know what? I really I really enjoy yes. that when um when someone reads a book and then shares like what they learned from it. Like see, Jim yes. always does that with me, and I really I really like it. Yeah, actually, so, ako naman may sa suggest ako. Sige nga. Um, have you uh, read Shoe Dog? No. Film. Shoe oh, Dog. Oh man, so ganda. It's about the founder. It's about, about uh, Phil Knight, the founder of Nike. It's okay, his, okay. It's his memoir. It's his story. Ah, sige and, uh, Grabe. As in, it, it takes you to his room in Portland where he had like, 
and then him going to China completely mag-isa to find, the, to to find, find like a, sh- a sneaker the manufa- and the manufacturer and ano and on ah, that's ng failures before in, he got there wild talaga as in super duper this, wild this this is mid 70s am i correct no uh, earlier pa Kasi 77 ata. Ano, 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 sorry, yan. si mga mga kasagot ng... I, but, I would say so. Sa, sa 70s, right? I would say so. Ah, si Prefontaine. Kailan si Prefontaine? The runner. So I guess, yeah, I think like 70s. Kasi noong time before that, yung dalawang magkapatid na Adidasler, eh, di ba? Yeah. Uh, Adidas, yun, ano, yan muna yung... Ah, sige nga, shoe. What's it called? Shoe, shoe dog. Shoe yung dog. Yung ni Adi Dassler is the owner of Puma. Sa Puma, Puma naman, yeah. yes. There's a town in Germany where they all came from and they were making the shoes. Mm-hmm. And then that's the story. Nag-split up sila. And then yung yeah. kapatid naman niya si Puma Dassler. Hindi ko alam. Hindi ko alam si Hans. 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 Talaga, invento na lang natin. Hans, Hans Dazzler. Adi Dazzler. Adi Dazzler. Parang baka, baka ma-flag ako na ano ha. Joke lang yun ha. Baka sabihin nyo ha. Ito. Anyway. Ito. Um, okay. Medyo. Okay, since we did books. May mga na-suggest na books. Uh, movies. What movies? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before oh. you start, stop. Can I suggest my dad's book? Ah, sure. sure. My, my dad wrote a book. Uh, called Firewalkers, which is a great. Um, it's fiction, but it's set in the in Cavite, where my father was Ooh. born. It's it's set in the turn of the century when the Americans had taken over from the Spanish, and it's uh, if you're in UP, it's required reading for if you're taking literature, and and, and it's a it's a really and the name of the lead character is Gabriel Jago, which is my brother and I. Oh, and it's sort of. It's yeah, so it's and it's it's also a there's a murder in this town. I don't want to spoil anything. And then of course, uh, the revolution is coming. The oh, because we come from a revolutionary. We're from Mendes Cavite, and my grandfather was really in Aguinaldo's army. And so my dad spun this really wonderful. I like it. Shempre, well, I want to say, but it's a really really great. It's wow. called Firewalkers. It's on Anvil. It was published twenty five years ago, but may UP Press publish it. And I think there's a PDF file that you can go online if somebody's listening, and it's good. My oh, his you. name is Erwin Castillo. So. Yeah. yeah, so oh, okay. It's, uh, I mean that's a good book. I, it's I'm a good gonna, I'm it's a really, it. really good do you think it's available uh, no, um, uh ebook? It should I, I don't know. Alam mo, alam mo, you be press me ebook. I'll ask him. So, yeah. But yeah, that's that's you a guys can click on the link below. Joke. We'll put the, uh, <laughs> the link on the description. <laughs> but the address but yeah. of Erwin Castillo. <laughs> yeah, of Diego so. Castillo. <laughs> I sorry. But yeah, that's that's I think it's a good it's a good, if you want to study Philippine history because it's it starts 1903 at tapos Oops. Hello? Yes. Hello, yes, I, yes. I disappeared. No, oh, there you no, there. there. Okay. Yeah, we got it. Okay. Sorry. Um, <laughs> sorry. Okay. Um so we're Movies. definitely getting that. Yeah, we want to Sorry again, get, Firewalkers by Erwin Casino. Firewalkers. Wow, great. Yeah. Um, <laughs> okay. Movies. Kayo muna, kayo first. What do I suggest? Watch, movies to watch during this time. Na parang uh, so obviously you're not gonna we're not gonna say something that was really na hindi wait na hindi Netflix or hindi HBO uh-oh. or so diba, more kasi, ayo nga pala paano paano ba paano like, papanoorin ng tao? Yeah, yeah, maybe maybe we should stick to what's available on Netflix. Yeah, okay. kasi okay. baka we will tell them to do something <laughs> that they shouldn't do. Oh nga. <laughs> I don't want to. Alam mo naman ang internet baka yari ako. <laughs> Bigay ko yung mga link, mga kaibigan. Nandito lahat. Okay. What about before that? What about we talk about the things, the, the movies that would be the worst to watch right now? Right now. Like, I, I know a lot of people have been watching Contagion. I think that's the worst idea ever. We watched it. <laughs> I knew it. We watched Why? it. Why? Why do you do that? Prior to the lockdown, ah, na sense ko na sabi ko kay Nikki, panoorin natin to. Eto yun eh. <laughs> Ay, sorry. Mas, pero ang galing eh. Sobrang yeah. galing. Ang ganda Sobrang talaga. galing. Ganda talaga. Um, you know what? 
Kasi ikaw, di ba, you're a zombie Yes. Movie. I was gonna say, guy, all the stuff I'm going to suggest is not good for Sabagagal. I think that's not good. Kasi kagabi, <laughs> naglalaro kami ni Jim ng zombie game, zombie video game, and I think oh, doon nag-starting so doon nag like, mini breakdown ko eh. Kasi while I was, I, we, were, we, were, I, okay. we were playing for like, how many hours is that? A long, uh, a long time. And then hours. towards the end, I was like, this is freaking me out. Kasi parang naisip ko, what if <laughs> Sorry. soon enough, that's what we're gonna be doing, like protecting our, you know, our ground. Yeah. But, yeah. That, what, but what, what's the best zombie? How about Shaun, Shaun of the Dead na lang? Oh, we watch that. Yeah, we we, see, that's a, that's a great, 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 yeah. great, yeah. great movie. Sobrang ganda. You know? And what is, um, what, 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 kasi, I I I I'm not well versed in zombie movies. What 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 would you say is like the uh the holy trinity of zombie movies? Everything that George Romero made. The original Dawn, the original Night of the Living Dead, the uh-huh. original Dawn of the Dead. Those are the two that are just and of course you can throw it in 28 weeks and 28 days later. Oh, uh, si ni yun? Si ni yun? Oh, si ni yun? Di ba si Sandra Bullock yung joke? 28 days. Pwede rin. Actually, panoori ko yun. Panoori ko yun kung may zombie film na kasama si Sandra Bullock. Kasi alam mo, hindi siya mamamatay eh. Diba? Hindi siya makakain. At sa kontrata niya yun eh. Uh, si ano, ang director, uh, sino nga 28 days later, love? The British guy. Si uh, Doyle? I think. But yeah, 28, you... <laughs> why why those? Why why those? Danny they, Boyle. Danny Boyle. Danny, Danny Boyle did Boyle. it. Before he won the Academy Award for Slumdog Millionaire. That's what he oh. was... Oh. But I absolutely hate Danny Boyle. What? What, what else did he make? He made Yesterday. Oh, so uh, Did you watch Have you seen that? Yeah, yeah. We saw, we saw it. We took it for face value. Yeah, it, Whatever. Pero kahit for face value man lang eh. It's a Beatles movie and they ended the movie with an Ed Sheeran movie. Uh, an Ed Sheeran song. Para dala kay ng backbeat yan, para din niya. There goes Stuart Sutcliffe. Could have been in the Beatles. Pero ano, ano ka ba backbeat? Hindi ka papanood. <laughs> Jim. <laughs> ang, ang music doon si Dave Grohl like the drums, si uh, Greg Dooley ang kumakanta na Afghan Wigs, si Thurston Moore yung nagigitara. Whoa. Wow. Really? Ano ba kayo? Yeah, backbeat. No. Oh, oh yeah, this came, yeah, that that's really good. And then the soundtrack, it's there. You can you can yeah, I, I saw on Spotify for sure. And it's a zombie movie? <laughs> no, 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 I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. The zombie films. I think here's Back why I oh. Okay, okay, okay. This is a great story. Uh when I was eight years old, I broke my arm. I had some cyst, which is still here. Oh. I had I had, I had some cyst that I had to stay home and blah blah blah. And while I was home. For months, I watched Dawn of the Dead for the first time. Eight years oh, old. Yes, my parents were kind of crazy. They, they allowed me to see this, like, you know, uh, they had the crazy son cooped up. Eh. So my brother and I, we watched this over and over and over again until we've memorized everything. We had this book, uh, Nick Potter or something, Marsha Wilson, parang movies on TV. So we were, we're checking, wait, Dawn of the Dead. They gave it a turkey. Mm-hmm. Turkey, meaning the worst film ever made. Flash forward, like nine years later, it's now a stone cold classic. Like yeah. any, mm-hmm. anywhere you go from Quentin Tarantino to every director, George Romero is the God. But I'm so happy like, that even as kids, we understood that this film was something else. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. And I think what it spoke to me was that, uh, and this is going to sound major, but and cornball. This is what really I feel. One, it was because in Dawn of the Dead, people wanted to go in the mall. Okay. The zombies wanted to go in the mall. And there's a line there na para, why are they coming here? Para, oh, this is probably what they remember the most. So it's almost like uh, it was sort of a veil thing on the consumerism. This was consumerism. done in 1978. And the world was changing. To, and sure enough, three years later, four years later, you know, Reaganomics, me, the me generation. My parents kept on saying, see, Romero had it right. He was already saying that this is really, that the hordes of undead are really us just sort of disconnecting and even though I'm a, cons- I'm a super consumer don't get mm. me wrong but it was sort of more than a zombie film uh. also what scared the living shit out of me was that my, my, my parents loved all these horror films so we'd seen everything Amityville I just tell them then we'll leave the house 
kung may mumu yung bahay, di alis tayo. Tapos. Kung, I never got kung, that. But wala ka na lang paipaglaban yung bahay tip, niyo. Diba? What, mismo. <laughs> what do we care? It's a house. Diba? And uh, if you're, pos- you know, may possessed yung utol ko, sorry. Sorry, guys. <laughs> eh, ganun eh. Alis na. Diba? Oh, diba? But then, when the zombie thing came, na walang mata, you can't hide. What if the person you love your, the most became a zombie? Yeah. Which is the existential question to eight year old, you know, an eight-year-old and an 11-year-old brother oh, would shit. ask themselves. And it was like, the when it never left me. I am an old person. It was still like, is this still Nikki? Do I have to shoot her in the head? Because yeah. in the movie, <laughs> their loved ones... Is she hearing are, you right now? <laughs> yeah, she can. <laughs> she can. Baka narinig lang niya, do I have to shoot her in the head? Because <laughs> the love, your loved ones, in the movie, kasi, your love, they're your loved ones, that's why they're out. They're keep them because they feel like they're sick. Also, my dad said, it's an analogy for drug addiction. Because oh. our family had you know, some struggles with some yeah. of this. And so I understood it. It's almost like you could see like, ganito nga eh. you're going to be shunned by society, you're going to be treated like you're a monster and you're going to be kept in a jail. Uh-huh. Galing, diba? There's many layers. Okay, that's probably not exactly what the movie is about, but I sort of, you know. Well, I think, parang, my, my question lang, I don't mean to cut you off, pero, <laughs> I love it, I love it so much. Because <laughs> <Do, do, laughs> those are the, the themes that are, ano eh, tackled by most zombie stuff that we've watched recently. Diba? Yeah. Parang, Walking I think, Dead. Walking Dead, uh, yeah. all these things, they, 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 they pose those questions, diba? And, and those themes. And I think what yeah. you're, what you're trying, can, is, correct me if I'm wrong, pero kung are yung, yung, um, Dawn of the Dead, um, those initial zombie films were the first, not just parang hack and slash, um, ha, 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 takbo, takbo, mumu. Yeah, type. yeah, yeah. There's, there's, it was much more than that. Meron pang, and of course, the original Night of the Living Dead mm. is obviously a political protest. I, I don't know if you've ever seen Romero's 68, it's black and white. It's called uh, Night of the Living Dead. Our protagonist is African American, guys. Mm-hmm. He's African American in a time where almost wala to serve with love lang ata yung mga Sydney point. Eh, konti konti lang, konti konti lang. Mm-hmm. And in the end, he survives the night. He survives the night of the Living Dead, but he's shot by Hicks. Hicks who are in this town, Spoiler. knowing full well. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. Pero ang galing, di ba? Parang, uh, yun yung wow. kwento. Diba? Parang, nabuhay na nga okay. siya, pero society, eh de, you're an African-American, we do ah. not love you. Puta. So, yeah. hayop tang ina, di ba? So, malalim siya, men. Parang, wow. it is more than, you know, he survives it. And in the end, he's... <laughs> I spoiled it nga, eh, no? So, so my, my wife said, It's okay. No, but, I mean, we've had that, all that, these years. <laughs> but that's why it's important. Like, that's why it's like parang some groundbreaking piece. Of, but it's still a zombie film, huh? It's yeah. people are eating, you know, there's still, there's the good guy, the bad guy, na parang ayaw tumulong, may bata. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, Is so that's Is this on it. Netflix? Unfortunately, no. It's not. All right. Uh, ito. Pero tiba Netflix cycles through. Yeah. 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 Uh, so hopefully, oh, it'll, 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 am I going Ay, again? Ayan, you're back. Yeah, you're back. Ayan. Ayan. Okay, I'm back. Okay. So, so yeah. Ito. Um, <laughs> okay. Now, here are... Harap, kinuwento ko yung... What are your favorite zombie films, guys? You tell me. What have you been watching? We don't is, watch ito, horror is, films. <laughs> okay, here's my question. But no, 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 no. This is this was you said you watched uh, uh, Walking Dead. Walking Dead. Yeah. Yeah. Is it still good? No. Is it still worth it? No. Diba? Ah, the, the, okay, Jim, 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 Jim has. Itong season na to? Yeah, the, the, season? the whole thing. Yeah, the last season. No. Ah, the last season was so bad. <laughs> diba? <laughs> Sobrang pangit na talaga. As in, <laughs> uh, it, uh, no, it, I think it was the most hard work no we put yet. in to watch. I'm sorry. Okay, di naman per sit down. Parang... Naluloy namin eh. We're like, kaya nga. Grabe, ang lala na talaga nito. Parang ginagago na tayo ng writers yeah, parang, talaga. Parang binabastos na tayo. Yeah. Totoo. They Totoo. don't want us to watch anymore. Sayang, no? Sayang, Sayang eh. talaga. Kasi sobrang niyang ganda eh. Ang sobrang niyang ganda. Uh, Tapos naging papangit ng papangit ng papangit na parang I'm hoping na kasi yung source material tapos na eh. And they're not yeah. anymore following it. Oh. Yeah. This is no spoiler. This is no spoiler. Just saying na parang <laughs> so parang hindi spoiler. na nila <laughs> <laughs> Spoiler ba yun? Hindi na ba? 
Ayun, yun, yun, yun. So, yeah. Okay, agreed. 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 Uh, ito. If we do a uh, lightning round. A lightning round. Okay. Uh, wait, I'm... wait, 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 wait. I have something else to share about oh, go, 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 Okay, go. 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 <laughs> I, love, I love it. I love it. I love Okay. Here's something that everybody misses when they do their zombie films. Mm. And I've told Quark na ito yung kulang. Mm. Okay. And, and, and bear with me. And Okay. When something is dead, what sense... Oh, how can you tell that there's a dead rat behind a door? <sighs> what What are the things that to clue you in outside actually seeing the rat that it's there's just something dead? Help me out. Well, the smell. Very good. Bing, 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 bing. Uh, Sam, the smell. Uh, so, the, so if there's something that's bulok, buong taong bulok, that's walking uh, through the hall, wouldn't you be able to smell it before it came through? Ah, uh, true. There is no film that ever references this. Okay, so I'll say, granted, maybe if you put an onion to your nose, eventually you get yeah. numb to it, right? Uh, yes. Yeah. But still, the initial thing when it is still the new outbreak, dapat, meron eksena na, na umi ko na sila, they're coming up. I don't know. That's my scene. If I can copy, any of patented exena ko yan. Kasi, nagaano no? well, well, not that the billions of zombie films that I see, <laughs> that I watch. Oh, I watch no, every. Di ba kasi dapat say bagong misan, outbreak palang tama. Pag, that's right. Kaling ni sa pag bagong pa sila, outbreak. Bakit hindi pa sila? Usually, di ba pag yung unang pag outbreak palang hindi pa sila sobrang decompose. But true, but there's some na bulok eh. Na para na so surprise sila pag open ng door. Wait, have you seen have you been watching Kingdom? Of course. Yeah, okay. The wife and I in the season 2. Love it. <laughs> Pero may nakakatawa gumawa ng meme. There's this okay. guy na parang sabi niya pag yung zombies daw, pag hindi pag hindi bida yung inahabol, talagang wah! Pero pag may, may bida, palalabas muna sila sabihin, ha! Yeah. <laughs> and then biglang tsaka pa lang tatakbo para may tatakbo. pause pa sila for close may pause uh, oh, dapat dapat <laughs> dapat kasi sayang naman lahat ng prosthetics di ba para <laughs> ano, eh. oh. ito uh, Diego how about since uh, kasama naman sa write up to pero you did write and direct a film yes with, with Quark and roll with Quark yes, yes. Um, do you have any plans uh, how, wait I guess, grabe, ang kaya pa nating habaan talaga oh, to. Okay. Do you mind if I... I think I... dapat, kasi gusto ko sana, maybe... Sige, sige, before we get there. Sorry, sorry. Okay, okay, okay. Nawala ako sa program flow ko eh. <laughs> um, according to my program, here's a, a quick lightning round thing lang. Okay, okay, lightning round. Okay. Lightning round, pero you have to explain... Your choice. Hindi ko magets, pero sige lang. Wala rin ako choice. Lightning. Uh, medyo lightning. Medyo lightning. Medyo lightning. Okay, okay. Lightning uh, round. Medyo lightning round. Okay. So, I will name a band. <coughs> okay. And then you give the album. Because basically, oh. these are the bands <laughs> that I love. Kinaparad ko yung mata mo, Jim. Baka tingin ka sa malayo. <laughs> okay. How about ka na, Jake? Okay. Uh, okay. These are bands that you love. And bands that I love. You need, and you will recommend one album from their catalog to deep dive into and why that album. Okay? Why that album? Okay. So, kunwari, sasabihin ko, um, sige, let's say, Wilco. Uh, ako, ko Wilco, uh, I'm trying to break your heart. Tama ba tayo? Yes. Ay, de, 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 uh, Yankee, 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 Foxtrot. Hotel, fa- hotel Yankee. Yankee, tamo? Yankee, <laughs> hotel, hotel, Foxtrot. Ah, yan. Yan. Uh. Yan, yan, ang, yan ang deep dive. And why? Because I think it's, one, it's their best record for me. Really? And quite, yes. Mm. Quite possibly the number one record in the last 25 years. Ganon kalaki yung praise ko sa kanya. At least top three. Yeah. Yeah. Because it's a mixture of experimental, of of dissonant things, of electronic yeah. things, of melodies like the Beatles, yeah. guitar solos like a motherfucker. Uh, Lahat ng gusto ko. And lyrics to boot. Yes. Yes. Great singing, and great Great subject matter. Great and even the, the, the context of when it was released, diba? Oh my. Because it was released oh right after... Post, post 9-11. 9-11 eh. 
And yes. he, according to them, hindi nga sadya na that if you see the album cover, it's two buildings, diba? Yes, in Chicago. Uh, so, that. Uh, a DVD that Jego lent me, which I haven't returned, um, <laughs> it's, it's okay. called I Am it's Trying Jago. to Break Your Heart. Break Your Heart. The documentary uh, showing how crazy that the process of making that album was. So, uh, again, ako, I realized actually medyo visual pala ako. So whenever I fall in love with a band, it usually starts with seeing something or um, reading about reading something about them. So yung sure yung journey sure. ko actually sa will go was uh, I remember we were in the airport and I parang sabi ko I really need to get into this will go thing. And then I read an article about Jeff Tweedy and his weird... what, what year was this? Sorry, the the, the one on this. Um. Kasi I really got hooked. Through, ano na lang eh, nung, e, parang right before the states. Be, before I would, I would know. I'd know. I'm trying to break your heart. I'd know some songs. Pero never ako naging ganito ka crazy. I think it it intensified after watching that DVD. Wa- after watching that, okay, right, and okay. uh, re- and then after I watched that, because I read the book called uh, Sunken Treasure. Yes. So it's, it's a deep dive on the Wilco albums. Anyway, lightning round. Ginift to kay Jim yung ano. Uh, let's go so we can come back. Huh? Go so we can come back. Ah, uh, the Tweety book. What's it? The Tweety book. Let's go so we can get back. Okay. okay. Um, okay. Sige. So semi lightning round. Okay. Naman. Uh, next Edge. one. LCD sound system. Whoo! LCD. Yung second record. The sound of silver. Yeah. You may, you may, uh, all my friends. All my friends. Ah, oh. yeah. <sighs> pero, pero close, close, close. Yan with the first record. Pero yung all my friends. Because uh, if you can share, Diego, get in um, a sa atan and jandin all my friends. But they, that's how it starts. Um, Go back to your. Kita kila buta na ako. Magaganda. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, ano ko is, is, is uh, ang ano ko is, can you can you explain uh, kasi diba James Murphy was a DJ in Brooklyn diba? talaga ng kwento ko is maganda story ko to ito okay, and okay, um <laughs> ano tawag dito so can you ano parang share and ako naman I'd like to ask you as a uh, as a DJ diba and as a rock musician parang what is the appeal? Oh, par- ne, de, parang kung magaha, can you break down even further? Parang how? Bakit sobrang gada? Because before before your turn, ako lang mabilis lang. No, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, no, I'm listening. The, I'm listening. The biggest difference between uh, LCD sound system and yung mga ibang uh, ano ba soul wax mga. Uh, Oya, oh, ingat ka dyan, ha? Ingat ka, wag, wag, wag ka magkakamaling laito ng soul wax ko. Hindi ko lina lahat. Hindi ko lina ko lang, the reason why LCD sound system is probably in my, kumari, in my Rushmore of bands and artists, com- they're the only very heavily electronica one. Sila yung parang dance music talaga doon sa catalog ng ano ko, favorites ko. Uh, as compared to, while, while I like kung ano yeah. soul wax, uh, mga justice, ganyan. Um, yeah, ba- yeah. The difference is Murphy can make such good songs. As in, i-play it on acoustic guitar, ang ganda pa rin ng sure, kanta. Sure, sure. Yun lang, that's what I wanted to say. Sure, sure. Ano to, sa pawad uh, so, na sige. Bakit siba? <laughs> diba medj lightning round for Jago to? Oh, okay. guy. Hindi ko lang. Try. Hindi ko lang. Ako na sabi ko lang. Sure, I agree. Sinagot mo eh. Hindi, hindi. Okay. I get it. I don't understand the question. What will I say? Parang I agree. I agree. Okay. The, okay. But, well, uh, and and I agree with you. They are. The, they're they're not just an electronic. Uh, parang baduy na sabihin yun. Kasi yung Soul Wax, dance band talaga yan. Hmm. Malayo yan sa top 100 ko. I just like huh. them for various yeah. things. Uh, ang story ko, I went to, here's my here's my LCD sound system story. Hmm. I was in New York 2004 and I, I was reading about them na. Parang the, the, the kills sila. And so I bought, I bought their debut record. And mm. I'm not going to lie. Dinuwi ko sa apartment, kasama ko si Mong, hindi namin nasakyan. It mm. was too advanced. Alam mo yun, yung parang, uh. ano to? Hindi namin masakyan. Uh-huh. Una, gusto namin yung Black Party. 
Yeah. So, ganda yung block party. Sabay yan eh. Parang that was the time. Block party, sila. Diba? Tapos parang killers. Mm. And it didn't dawn on me till unti-unti later how parang, you know, there was just, maybe because I was looking for the hits. Ah. Uh. Quote-unquote, yung parang hits. Mr. Brightside, that may ganito. Parang, mm. But it, it sort of unfurls itself the more you listen to it. As to this day, it is, hindi siya badui. It's still, mm. yeah. I think it's still great. And, mm. um, and maybe because mga musikero kayo, the instruments resonate. They, the way the uh. production is done, they're just crazy from yung drum sound nila na ano. And if you're a fan like me of like Blondie or of, ito ah, Talking Heads really is, is LCD sound system. I'm, that's what yung, I haven't ano ito, yun yung hindi ko pa na, girlfriend is better girlfriend is better yung instruments tapos mm. if you listen to Kraftwerk lahat it's an amalgamation of all these cool 70s bands na dinikit-dikit nila and then they made it current they sang about mm. stuff that that's hip yung pa hip kasi mm. si, in a good way ha? yung mm. cool eh cool talaga eh parang yeah. ikaw ha? galing minsan na annoy ako sa kanya parang yabang mo as parang <laughs> pa yung, may inter- yung, pa yung may interview galing mo men <laughs> wala, wala ka masabi you know so I think he had elements of the dance stuff because he was collecting all these records he liked these weird things also the guitar sounds great the drum sounds great the keyboard you can dance to it pati yung mga rock nila maganda wala ka masabi nakaka wala lang it's just good stuff yeah. yeah, I guess that's why. <laughs> Yo. Mas gusto kayo sagot ni Jim ata. Ne, ne, ne. Pwede ba? Sam, doon na lang ako. Uh, I agree. I agree. <laughs> okay naman pareho. <laughs> Judge. <laughs> um, ano ba ba? Ikaw, like, uh, Sam, do you like LCD sound system? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Actually, more... Mas pinakinggan ko sila when I got together with Jim. I... Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think one of the things when because is, um, like you said, I think most music talaga. Kaya, I know it's always for me. It's always contextual talaga. Eh. Yeah. Parang uh, hindi ko masakyan ang LCD before. Kasi ayun nga sabi mo. I was so busy with anthemic things. I was looking yeah. for the. It's just yeah. my. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Miss one, miss one. Um, and then Wilco. <laughs> During that time, I was still. Ah, kailangan ko ng uh, kailangan ko ng kasing bigat ng smashing pumpkins and all that. No, no, but I understand. Hindi ko hindi alam mo yun, parang yeah. hindi ko masakyan. And I think it, But then but then because it's contextual, ako personally, like with Wilco, kaya rin ako sobrang ano sa kanya kasi yung memories niya it's attached to our um US Very tour. good. Yeah. Very good. Super. That's so sobrang you know the flight. Yeah. Lagi kami you were listening to Wilco and then and we talk about ev- parang every time. So I think it's really good memories attached to yeah, it. Yeah, mag- maganda yung memory. And of course, but, it's really good songs anyway. Yeah. yeah. But that's the function of, I think that's the function of music naman talaga. In general, you know, it, 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 it and there's nothing wrong with not understanding it. In the beginning, ako ang dami kong plaka na parang, ha, huh, gusto magustuhan. Tapos ngayon parang, like, I never thought myself would be a fan of like, weird dance music or techno or house. But ako am the last person but now I understand it more than ever. All these weird psych records which used to bore the living shit out of me. Oh. Ngayon gusto ko na sila. But that's yeah. the great j- joy. Sorry, Sorry go, ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Finish that. But, Finish that, that, that but that's the great joy of this continuing to listen to music and it's panapanahon. Like, like there's a moment na it just unlocks itself. Wow. There's stuff that Nikki likes that no una di ko gusto. No, and then that shared experience you have like Kayo, and that mm-hmm. just wala na yon. Like uh, because you mentioned that when we were on our honeymoon, we were listening to a lot of cardigans. Mm-hmm. So now so, yeah. my new my new idea of what cardigans is is our European vacation, and mm-hmm. it adds and it adds and it adds. See, but para maybe before it was about this. So I like that idea that it just brings you into different foundations into different basis of your life na para oh, masaya to ito yung naalala ko nung uh, kita kami nila Jim and Sab sa ganito parang I don't know that's yeah, yeah that's that's just... actually the funny thing is the last time we hung out at your place dini deep dive mo ako sa cardigans sa cardigans <laughs> <laughs> when they were here we were listening to cardigans okay yeah, so yeah. I'm sorry I'm telling my wife uh, yeah. our story she's just right over there yeah. <laughs> uh, ito my wife just told me Nikki just said that her New York uh uh, parang memories ang soundtrack is you guys because we listen we listen to you guys 
shit, Lord of Time. Only Asa because yeah, eh. inaaral mo yung songs namin. Well, yeah. well, 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 true. You played but, guitar for us during that yeah, tour. Yes, which I'm, so thank you for a uh, very honored. That was a great, but, 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 but irregardless, that was our, I don't know, asa yan na. We, 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 uh. we, we, that's our memory when we hear your songs is us in New York. Right. As, and, you know, so galing. That's, that's the great function of, I think. Of and Sandwich was the theme song of my youth. Youth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> of my and, look, and look how you turned that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> pero, pero no. Wait, my question pala ako. Sorry. Go, go, go. Keep going. I just, because you mentioned like you like, sabarang walang connection to, by the way. Yes. You mentioned like, bigla na lang gusto mo ng dance music, ng house music. Can I just, because I never... I have okay. never been into, into house it. music. Yeah, I understand. Why is it called house music? <laughs> you know what? I was watching this documentary and I also don't know. Uh, I think literally because the, the, the pioneers of this, of, in, 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 you know, we're doing it at home. Yeah, ta, I don't know if this is true. Oh. Ano ba ng house? Ano ba? Yung, yung may four on the floor. Yung parang rin tech. Parang rin yung Detroit house yung four. Two. Two. Yan. Yan, tamin, sa sabay mo, Jim. Two. Very good. Two. <laughs> you may four. <laughs> you may four on the floor. May parang African-American lady na. Ha, da, da, da. So, yan, yung, yan, mga, yung mga head guard, cords, yun ba, house yun? Mga, ay, ako, hindi ko na alam yung head guard. Pero yung mga, ta, 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 yung may mga minor. Ha, ta, 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 ha. Now that you're doing this, I think I can get into it. Papaganong ka na, hu, gano'n, gano'n. Now that you're doing it, sobrang game na ako. Game na ako sa house. Kasi, kasi, si Nikki, ganun din. Parang, mas gusto kayo mga funk-funk na ginagawa yung D-Maps eh. Kaya masaya. Pero pag yung parang, pero little by little, <laughs> Nagugustuhan na rin niya kasi gusto mo yung Kasi wala siyang choice Wala siyang choice eh. Para ha ha ha, ha. <laughs> Tapos ang tagal dumating ng ibang parts Ano lang hmm. Parang nakagano yung toso Nasaan na ba yung isang part? <laughs> so I think that's why they, it's, it's said na Drug adult ka dapat may, para may, ma- may bagsak Kasi ang tagal eh Oh. Pero ako kahit na hindi Yan Iba pa yan Hindi ba EDM? Hindi ba iba yan Iba yan Ito talaga ano lang actually si D Maps ang nag-inspire sa akin parang eventually para nagusto ako na to na kaatik puro yun nalang gusto ko pahinggan ano what 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 should we listen to ano if if you want to get into house uh, you, you know what? On Spotify, you can just type on a lot of stuff. I hear up because uh, there's so many. Uh, I hear up. You know what? I can can I put a link on your you know, mamaya I about hear. some a mix of like house tracks. <laughs> yeah. sure. And then of course the the ito pa. And and I'm going to offend people, the mga purists, because you know somebody will say like, "Ni naman kasi daming subgenres." Eh. Alam ko lang, kami ni Jago, nagkakaintindihan kami na, yung parang house natin na uh, soul. Ang, ang gulo, no? Kasi, hello? Sorry, Ay, sorry. we lost you there. Parang, oh, soul. parang yung house nyo. Diba yung parang soulful house? May ganun oh. eh. May ganun na, yun nga yung may parang may backing na na African-American woman singing parang medyo mm-hmm. falsetto is tas mm-hmm. may, may, may stab na keyboard is napapaganong-ganong ka parang mm-hmm. saya parang yung gusto ko but then meron din mga ibang types of genres na hindi ko naman masakyan mm-hmm. masyado ng ito kasi parang it's almost like you're listening to to Motown but with a with a 4-4 backbeat oh I know, it's, I know it's hard to explain and it's very sparse like nothing's really happening and different elements add. So when that element comes in, napapaano ka, woo! You know, woo! <laughs> <laughs> kasi, kasi kay, kay D-Maps ko nakukuha sa so parang, ah, oh, what? No? Parang, yun na, nasira na yung ulo ko. Parang naging rabbit hole na yun. Speaking and I was the last, go ahead. So, <laughs> Galing, no, go, go ahead, finish that. <laughs> no, 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 kasi, kasi, <laughs> kasi, si D-Maps, you very infectious yung Wait, I'd like to plug. 
Bimax is a is a genius. Yeah. Yeah. He is. Yeah. He We're is talking genius. about Diego Mapa, by yeah. the way. Diego Mapa is a musical genius. Yeah. Everything he does. Yes. From Egg Boy, Egg Boy. Mm. Medica, to Tarshos, everything is mm. world class. Sorry, I just wanted to add that. Anyway, so si Diego That's doesn't agree. Mean, And then he has this power to affect you. Na parang napapaganong ganun siya. Parang ganda. Parang sasakyan ko lang. Parang, o nga, gets ko na. Tapos purus yun na lang. And, and sometimes I get to get to inspire him to do yeah, some yeah, stuff. Sure. And so, so that's it. So, sorry. Speaking of the wanted... Jegos, yeah. You guys made our wedding after party such a success. Everyone was saying how you guys just brought the house down. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. No, Sabi thank nila, you. they especially yeah. love, love the house music that you guys play. Aray ka, aray ka, aray ka, aray ka. The house music. Kaya ay lang ka. So sabi nila, ba doon naman yung house house na yan? Also, uh, thank you, Jim, for uh, performing. And you yes. both, and, and Cheats were performing at, at our wedding. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, one, yes. one of the best was, weddings. That, Actually, might be Sabi ko nga eh, I think that do. may be the first and last time that uh, not last pero I mean I, I kumbaga for me I just for the listeners I was able to play at Diego's wedding Diego and Nikki's wedding uh well Nikki uh, for the for the march the aisle. yeah so uh, for me that was like the greatest honor ever Uh, si and Jim I kasi may frustration siya na feeling niya oh, hindi siya magiging so best no, man ng kahit sino. <laughs> <laughs> kasi lahat ng mga parang best friends niya may brothers. Uh, <laughs> okay, that, that makes sense. Uh, that, that pero sense. anyway, the, that was such a great honor. That's uh, the closest thing I guess to being a best man. Oh. Uh, Sad. Guys, Jim, Jim, you and Tony were the <laughs> showstopper. Yeah. Showstopper. Showstopper. Thank you, thank na, na cry, na cry kami. Na sobrang. I remember yeah. the phone call. You should share. I, I, you should oh. share what you guys sang. What do you mean? I mean, for the listeners. Yes, yes. yes. Ah, uh, we sang uh, Wilco, you and I, and everlasting everything. So. Super ganda. Super ganda. I mean that just and then of course sheets played. So yeah. super. It was just. That is our uh, favorite day of our lives so far. <laughs> right, Mrs. Yes. One year na kayo. Mm-hmm. Grabe. Time flies. <laughs> Time flies. <laughs> Sorry, but you were going to say something before. Sab was going to say something, but... Uh... Hindi, yun na yun. <laughs> ah, ito. Diego. I want to let... I, I think what we can do, we can do a part two. Definitely. Of course. Let's have a... Kung gusto mo mag-beer tayo. Yeah, yeah, of course. Inu mandayo. Kasi ano ka, monthly recurring guest. Yeah. I want to talk about <laughs> your dad as well and what oh, he meant. That would be fun. Kasi like, what what sorry. what he meant to, to to not just me and 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 that's a great story. Kasi hindi naman ako parang si Rames na e heads. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Kasi because people might misconstrue. Kasi sure, mga sikat sila no. I I was no one. Like, but mm. your dad treated me as if though. I mean, sincerely, as in. Ah, hero pa. Eh. Sala, la, la, sala, galeng, ang galeng. Talagang he treated me as if though and then I'll, I'll skip those stories, but those are true stories, my own stories. Like like I was nobody. He 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 treated me as if though I was super special. I took that and I did what I did today partly because of your dad. Aww. That is a true story. That uh and ako lang makakwento noon because this is my story, you know. Mm-hmm. I didn't know I didn't know him from Adam. I just said yeah. like You know, I I such a big you know I did I went I went to your show and took and then he was and that was it. And then I became your dad's friend. You know, that's so um that's exactly what I told Rims in our episode previous episode. Na sinabi ko there would be no cheats if hindi niya ako linapitan sa Boracay and sinabi niya na na you guys are good. Ako like again I was completely a nobody and I thought like. We were playing shitty music, and then like, as compared to what very, I will, it's very opposite to what happened with you. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Which I don't remember, but. Kwento mo Jim. Nee, sa next episode, kasi. Sa next. Alam mo, and dami natin. What I want, I want Jagorin to share is yung transition niya from. Yung kumbaga, kasi sobrang interesting nung kwento nung nag-BMG ka, you had a corporate job. And... <laughs> Yer ka libro ko eh. Ganda yan eh. Yes, yeah, you really... Kasi I, I, was, I was there for River Maya. I was there for Eraserheads. I was there for Sugar Hiccup. 
I was working there. So I had some privy to some stuff that was happening. And uh, Mr. C. Yeah. No one know. else could write that Le- book but you. Le- Lea Salonga. I have. Alam mo, Jigs, may naisip ako bigla. Yo. <laughs> Why don't you make it an audio book? Oh. Wait, before that, you can still write your Actually, book. Actually, yeah. Pero yeah. aside from that, you can make a podcast, podcast series. series. I will produce it with you. Sure. Put sure. him on the spot. <laughs> ne, ne, ne. Sure. Pero, pero just so you know, listen to what... E- Kuhane, super sikat na yun ngayon. ESPN did a 10-part series on the Sterling Madness. Yeah, I and never got like, to listen to it. It's a journalistic It's basically podcast. a... Um, ang ganda. Parang chap. Parang kung ano, blah, 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 rock and roll in a sand, sandwich or whatever. Um, Ito na nga uh, intro ko eh. Uh-oh. Diba? So when I finally got into BMG Records, I'm thinking, this is it. I'm going to change it. I'm going to sign every band out there who I think deserves to be signed. Then my boss tells me, Pogi ba yung mga yan? True oh. story! Oh, yung ganda ng intro na yun. True story. I would buy that just for ilan the ng, blurb. Ilan kaya mabibenta natin dyan? Uh, uh, <laughs> then you realize it's a business oh, and it's not as man. easy but even with the best intentions because I'm going to get fired yeah I don't want to lose my job but I also want to change you know galing, diba? sorry that I'm brainstorming here because I'm excited ah! Pero, <laughs> Jago, imagine sorry because I'm going to producer Wait, sir, we are, we're May, going live in 10 <laughs> minutes we're going live in 10 minutes but uh Jago, isipin mo na lang. You're a DJ and ang dami mong kwento. Basically, what you're doing at Foaming in, at the Mouth, diba? Yeah, so, yeah. Pero, you do it a 10-part series per chapter. And then you're you're narrating and then you can insert... Uh, kung hari, there this was the time the Wolfgang was going. This was the biggest hit. Okay, can we do anyway. this like off cam? Oh nga, sorry, sorry. Okay. Baka naka-wip idea. Pinaplug ko na eh kasi baka sumabog. Oh, baka. The, the streams will... Yeah. <laughs> you heard it here first, guys. All right. All right, uh, All right thanks guys. I know you guys gotta part go. Part 2 episode, it's gonna be called Jego Castillo is Cancelled. <laughs> 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 Para permanent, permanent member na ninyo. Just call me anytime, y'all. <laughs> Movies, films, yeah. uh, local seed. Super fun. <laughs> So you Actually, so you should be, you should be our ano guest palagi kaya pag movie club. We're starting a movie club eh, where we say a movie and then our listeners yeah. will watch it and then you we can discuss. call on me for anything. <laughs> <laughs> Sabay hello, Jags. <laughs> hey, sorry guys, I'm busy. Luto. Sorry guys, I'm luto pa. Nanat na ako ni Mrs. Thanks. Ah, oh, say hi to Nikki. Yeah, say hi Bye, to Nikki, Nikki. and we'll, we'll have her on time. the show Bye too. Now. Bye, guys. Thank, thank you. You guys be safe. Everybody, thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye, Bye. 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 Be safe. Thank you so much. Bye. Bye.